Hey there, welcome back, and today I'm going to be talking about the WRC, and we're going to be talking about Rally Monte Carlo, currently underway, however for the first two days, including today, the first full day of competitive action, there have been a few problems. It's not been with necessary competition, it's been with WRC Plus. Now, if anyone is, like myself, a WRC Plus subscriber, I'm subscribed to All Live. You'll know that the connection to All Live has been unstable so far through the event. There have been uh, a lot of drops of connections, and a lot of people are not happy about that. And saying things like that is a bit of them. So, I mean, by a bit of them, saying something, people are absolutely furious. Now, I have a couple of things to say about this, because all the things that's come up and come to light is that it largely seemed to be a problem with WRC Plus as a service. Broadcasts on TV, so here in the UK and BT Sport, were largely unaffected. But There were some problems, and it's not great that it kept happening. But at the same time, you have to give some benefit of the doubt to WRC. Um, we had problems with the all live coverage or any WRC class coverage. Uh, last season, there were lots of problems with it in Monte Carlo, and part of it is it's the first one of the season. Part of it last year was it was the first one for all live, but again, some of that should not be excuses you have to make. Like I could understand if the problems were tech-based or problems were with the upload rates. But at least be honest about that's what the problem is. That's what it comes across as to me, that's what it comes across as the issue is. But the more public you are about these issues, the less angry the fans are going to be. I've seen lots of people who are regretting buying all live passes now and that's a shame because I've enjoyed having my all life pass and the renewal comes up in around three weeks time. So it's a shame, but what can you do? I'd like to hear you guys thought, so let me know down below. Um, like I said, personally I believe it's a matter of pure circumstance, but I believe that the brand should be more public in admitting the problems. If you agree or disagree, let me know. We can have a nice conversation going about it. Otherwise, it's been a really fun event to follow so far. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you again soon. Bye-bye for now.